October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and tonight we are turning our attention to men. According to the CDC, about 2,400 men have been diagnosed with breast cancer just this year. The night team's Alyssa Cole spoke with a male breast cancer survivor who's working to eliminate the stigma. He told me <laughs> that I had cancer, you know, uh, breast cancer, and that uh, we needed to get an oncologist for me. At 72 years old, Joe Villarreal was diagnosed with stage three breast cancer in July 2021. Now he is a month in remission. Very seldom do you hear them say something about the, uh, men's breast cancer. What's normally seen as a woman's disease, breast cancer is diagnosed in 1% of men. Medical experts say age plays a role. Men age 50 and older have an increased risk of developing breast cancer. I need to get checked for prostate. Why don't you get checked for breast cancer? I think that there are many men that don't even realize it can happen. Oncology nurse Pam Colmey is a breast cancer navigator at a Methodist hospital metropolitan. Experts in her field say it's more common for men to develop a lump around the nipple because that's where they have the most ductile tissue. They can have a lump in and around their, their breast, right? Or uh, sometimes it presents as a lump under the arm. In Joel's case, he found a lump in his armpit. He had it surgically removed along with seven lymph nodes that has led to occasional swelling in his left arm. He says he didn't experience physical pain, but recalls side effects during treatment and therapy. Calling my wife, hey, I'm freaking out of here. My hair's all coming off. Uh, so we just decided we might as well cut it all off because it's going to all fall off. Mm -hmm. But as soon as the chemo ended, it started growing back. Looking back on the journey up until now, Joe was grateful for the people who stuck by his side through it all. My wife was my biggest supporter. Uh, she was always there for me. And she, she went to every doctor's appointment I had. She kept tabs of what they were doing and uh, the medications I was supposed to take. Now, there are other factors that could lead to an increased risk in male breast cancer diagnosis. Their obesity, previous radiation therapy in the chest area, and a family history of breast cancer. We have a list of additional risk factors and information on our website at ksat.com. Alyssa Cole, KSAT 12 News.